My grandfather lived in Mississippi and he was an organizer and he worked with the, the NAACP and he worked very closely uh, with Medgar Evers. He would drive uh, people in his community to the polls uh, there and back. One of the stories that my my mom would, would tell me growing up is that one of the times when he was coming back um, from driving people to the polls, it was late at night, his car was, was stopped by, by, by two cars and the people in the car were um, from the KKK and so they were just throwing every curse word in, in the book at him, yelling at him and in this moment my mom tells me that my, my granddad was just resilient and steadfast. He was a preacher as well and he just started speaking and started yelling the Bible at these KKK members over and over and over again and they just called him a, a stupid crazy n-word and then they left. And so it was just a really it was just a really powerful story that you know he, he wasn't scared and he felt like God was guiding him through um, that entire situation and I feel like when you come from something like that, it's hard to resist the call to this sort of work.